Welcome everybody, this is your boy Jordan Matoro and we are here with another video. Like always, if you like the video, smash the like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more content and we're going to get straight into the video. Welcome back everybody, now before we do get straight into the video, I would like to give a big shout out and thank you to the supporters of this YouTube channel. A big shout out to Wee's GNZ Gaming, Maori Superman YT and even Foxy. Now these people are our YouTube members on our YouTube platform and I really do appreciate their support. So why don't you go inside my description below and go check them out and we're going to get straight into the video. Now this video is all about on how to install add-on pads inside your Grand Theft Auto V folder. So like always make sure that you download and install all of the latest requirements that's inside my description below. Once you have completed that process, then download this mod and I will leave this mod inside my description below. This mod does require Pete Selector and I will leave this inside my description below. And we will be using this Team Paid mod to test the mod to see if it works. Now this pad is only optional, you can download it if you want to, it's totally up to you. But I will leave this inside my description below as well. That's if you want to download this mod. So the first thing that we gotta do is go to your Grand Theft Auto B game. Hover over it, right click and open file location. Now next, go to your mods folder. Go to your update folder, go to your time 64 folder, then go to your DRC packs folder. Now open up your add on peds extract folder, then go to your DRC packs folder, and simply select your add on peds folder and drag it inside your DRC packs folder. Go back to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder. Then go back to your extract folder. Then go back to your main folder inside your extract folder. And I'll select add on peds vars and add on peds editor.exe. Drag both files inside your Grand Theft Auto V main folder. Next, go to your readme.html, double click, scroll down and stop until you see the DRC packs line. Copy the DRC packs line and now exit out of your extract folder. Open up your open IV. Go to your Grand Theft Auto V windows. Now this process will take a few seconds. Go to edit mode, select yes, go to mods, go to updates, go to update.rpf, go to common, then go to data, then scroll right down to the bottom until you see drclist.xml. Right click, select edit, then scroll right down to the bottom and now come over here with your mouse press press enter and now paste the code over there save it go back to your gta v and now just minimize that for now because we will come back in here very soon now next go back to your grand theft auto v main folder Go to your scripts folder, make sure that you have the latest native UI as well. Now open up your peds selector 
extract folder select your DLL file and drag it inside your skits folder then exit out of your extract folder then go back to your Creative Audio V main folder now lastly open up your paired extract folder then go back to your open IV go to your mods folder go to updates go to time 64 go to DRC packs go to add-on pairs go to DRC.RPF go to pairs.RPF and now if you see any um, files and folders in here simply select them all right click and delete okay delete them all now go back to your paired extract folder and now select them all so select the whole three of them and drag it inside your open IV now next uh, go to edit mode go to GTA V exit out of your open IV and now just drag this folder down a bit now grab one file only one file and paste it onto your desktop exit out of your extract folder go to your file right click rename copy that name then now you can delete it if you want to and now bring this back up and now go to your add-on piece editor.exe right click and then now run as administrator and now your add-on piece editor will pop up now go to your page drop down menu select new paid and now paste your paid name that you copied right there paid type it is a female it is streamed true and then add paid then rebuild and then ok and now exit out of your out of paid editor then now lastly right click refresh your game folder exit out of your game folder right click refresh your desktop and now I will see you guys in the game and now we are in the game with Franklin so once you're in the game okay all you gotta do is go on your keyboard and press your L key and now you'll see that then now go to add on pins and you'll see the pin over there press enter and now there you go and a hundred percent works so i hope you guys do enjoy the, your mods and now uh, we're back again so i hope you guys do enjoy that mod it's an awesome mod but like always okay if you guys do get stuck installing this mod then please let me know in the comments and i'll be more than welcome to help out on that or if you do get stuck installing any other mods from gta v or cyberpunk then I will be more than welcome to help out on that as well. Now, unfortunately, I'm not active inside my YouTube comments. I'm more active inside my Discord server. So I will leave my Discord server linked inside my description below. So join my Discord server for fast reply and fast help. So with that said, if you guys did enjoy the video, or if the video was helpful, then smash that like button and subscribe for more content and tutorials. And I will see you all on my next video. Thank you for watching. Peace and I'm out.